That's pretty Pog. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Alright, they're cool. getting into game, and it's uh, not the character I thought he'd be playing. Two, one, Aaron, yeah. I don't know, I feel like in this matchup, Karen's gonna struggle a little bit. Yeah. Same, just, you know, character attributes is what I would get it, claim at first, uh, you know, without ever having played the matchup or either of these characters in my life. Yeah. That's what I would guess. Like, how many Karen's have you seen in Burger, I guess? Oh, I mean, I played versus Q's Karen quite a bit, actually. Okay. And, um, and versus, um... Oh my god, I feel so bad, I can't remember. That's sad. We have, we have a few other cards that I have played versus in friendlies. <laughs> so, and this character, you know, they've been around since the first match that four days. Not entirely dissimilar. That move though, sends straight out now. Um, probably. Can't remember. This is it's still hard, you know. Yeah. That that was bullshit. They'd have to hit from behind. Brad, did, Brad was on the wrong side to get that punish, but it didn't matter. Nice parry to f still on the nerves, that's what you need. It's nice to have like the huge range of that like parry, like punish option out of parry. Yeah. Again, I think Q went for the parry, but um, maybe really shield a bit early, so he got hit by like for the, for the back air. Oh, that's it though. Wow. What a, it was just like, you know, when someone's at ledge, um, and you want, you know, that you think they're gonna sit in shield, so you get go and grab them. Oh no, you. Oh. It's alright. It's at 194. It doesn't matter. Yeah. Um, but you know, like someone's at ledge, right? You're like, well, if you're at ledge, you're like, I don't want to sit on the ground because they're gonna like come grab me. So like, you're like, I'm gonna full hop, and then Brad just kind of ran straight under the full hop and got near back in. <laughs> yeah, <that's laughs> Be... Yeah, it's hard. It's hard. It was very early. You got yeah. there at like 70. Yeah, I was gonna say it was at 70. Yeah, it was very early. Um, but that is it is a Greninja thing of like it's really hard to call out jumps because like there and you have sort of I guess back here is like a sort of a lasting hitbox, but most of your hitboxes are like precise. Yeah. It's really hard to call out a jump at the exact spot they're gonna be. You need like you want like really active hitboxes to do that normally. That's such a good option the forward air like pulling forward. Um, yeah, could get off yeah, like exactly. Well, exactly what he needed. Mm. We're looking at pretty much the same situation as we were the last first the last game. And this yeah. time, this time Brad not running underneath you. He's full hops. Yeah. Just kind of like staying in the middle of the stage, but he got the better of the exchange and managed to get the pin off stage. So. Mm. Very the pin will catch you. Yeah. If you're not ready for it. It's really hard to be ready for it. It's a fast move. Oh, uh, that was unlucky. Falling up stage there. No, getting no concern from it. See, that time, Brad even tried to call out a jump, but he was just a little bit... His, 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 his hitboxes were just too slow. He was already, like, throwing out an attack. Yeah. It's hard when, like, you can just, like, throw out fares on theirs, and, like, Taichu's trying to, like, jump into him, and he's gonna get hit. Confirms? Yeah, maybe. I think you've got to get the edge guards, but he's yeah. finding ways around it with like well timed forwarders. Yeah, I think that's really um, Some of his upbeats have been like getting, you know, hitting Brad instead of like him getting. Still enough damage right now. Oh, it's a weird interaction. Both ways. Alright, yeah, that's some damage. Up air, up air, triple up air. We're gonna live though. But we still have to get down. Oh, sneaky at us. Is that not hit on the platform? Surely it does. He might have been a purple tank. Yeah, he gets the rolling. And here, what do we get? We have a full hopping, we're double jumping, and we're back in the middle of the stage. That's basically how Q's been getting out of ledge every time. It's like just full hopping, finding a way to land with an aerial that's safe. Oh, what a read. If Fred was like. No! Okay. That's unlucky. Yeah, you got the I, I was gonna say something about a previous interaction, but so Brad obviously wanted, you know, it's a hip, it's a, it's a recovery of a hitbox. Yeah. So I'm gonna go counter it and spike you. Yeah. Previously but, he got, he tried to edge guard, got hit by. But it. I guess his, I yeah. guess his like, I guess his counter is just too slow. <laughs> yeah. He, he was already, he was like, I'm already, I already grabbed ledge, bro. Where are you, where are you going? I didn't even see a move. He just plummeted down. Yeah. No, he counted. He did the down counter. Yeah. So like. <laughs> Um, the, the game score's wrong, I'm sorry, we forgot to... Oh, 
Oh, Swap that from last set. All good. Here's 1 0 up now. This is winner's semi. Winner's semi. I'll update this too. That's it's still best of three. Or is this it is five? still best of three. Okay. It's only top four. Best of five, yeah. um, nice work from Q, getting first game. Oh, fair up air, up air. Some, da some damage. That's that's and Fred got one hand, got thing. He got his he got his, he got his dash tag up smash. Oh no, we have no jump. I think he just died. Oh. Yeah. This so the ground has like no drift after up air, so you have to actually like grab the ledge. Oh, you're just gonna go full straight down afterwards. Yeah, so he couldn't he couldn't get back even with the like back air to like push him a little bit. Oh no! Don't get hit by landing forward air when you're at zero. It's the, it's the, they're always going to fish for it. That leads into fair to dash back to up smash. Or just even back air in that spot, you know. Oh no, I wouldn't put yourself there. <laughs> like, he got back fine, but I still wouldn't have done it. <laughs> Putting yourself up stage like that, like, you, you, you're basically like semi spiking yourself, you know. With yeah. like the angle you get set up. Mm. Brad, Brad doing a few too many like full hop landing aerials. He's like, alright, I'm just gonna stand in place and up. <laughs> yeah. And Brad fell into it, so. Mm -hmm. Ooh, sneaky roll on. Alright. Ah. Uh, gets up at the wrong time. Uh, he's always finding the way back in. He's always like finding that one 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 hole in Brad's like sort of stage control. Yeah. Yeah. Ah, oh, what a, maybe he could have got something even better off of that. But if he gets this shot, he might. Oh, he at least he still gets up to this thing. Yeah. See, there's the there's the like full hop landing safe area, and then he just like rolls in right off of that. But Brad will get the fuck anyway. Awkward get up timing, yeah. <laughs> See, on, like, faster on the trigger there, because uh, Greninja's frame out is definitely better. So when they clank like that, you'd expect the Greninja to, like... Whoa! Right. Yeah, he shut me up. I was talking about frame darting. Yeah, <laughs> He's like, get that, catch this tipper. Uh, two frame meat, maybe. He yeah. might have... I don't know, that was, that was nice. That was funny. Yeah, full hop, landing fair. And then he gets some damage. Aw, oh, but... I think Greninja's, like, low profile, and the... Oh, like, the up landing up air wasn't... Like, can't even hit him on the tech. Oh, we're just running. We're just chasing Q. Oh, my goodness. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. These are some real greedy, um... Brad's going for like double jump on stage when he's off stage, like instead of going to ledge. But and Q's like almost reading the best smashes, but he's getting hit before like he can release the move. Um, we'll see if that comes into play. Maybe Q will actually like get the kill off of it. Like, he's getting greedy. Oh no! Okay. Mm. And a lot of landing fair kills too. I mean, you'll see that a lot of Greninja when they if he doesn't get down tilt up smash or down tilt fair. Probably just a probably just a raw fair on landing. Yeah. What you're gonna see a lot of. Start the battle. Mm. Where are they going? I like the zero drop frames this game. Yeah. The scores have been right the whole time. What do you want? Yeah, I don't believe. I don't care, bro. Nah, I don't know. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> oh yeah, see that's Greninja's side B is just not very good because like even in situations where you like kind of read your opponent, it's just not like dimensional K, you know. You want to use it like men that might use dimensional K, but the problem is that like Greninja comes out and he's like, you can hit him before the hitbox comes out. So we like he just side B straight into a Q nair basically. He's often using Nair and Fair to get off the And they're doing really well. Yeah. Fair? Oh, he got back air snuck in just before his Fair Oh, That was a nice fade back from Q, so he kind of jumps. 
And then Brad was like reading a drift in stage and did like a retreating forward air. So Q just like faded back to ledge, gave up a little bit of stage control but didn't die. Yeah. Kind of the mix up, you know. Um, oh, yeah, nice. jump in. yeah, that was. There we go. The one like sort of act really active option Greninja has to catch jumps. So if they're at kill percent for back air, you might as well use use that tool for that, like for that purpose. Uh, there we go. We had a lot of um you doing full hop landing aerial into roll in and Brad caught that roll in with a dash back. So I don't know if that was like sort of an intentional um adaptation or if it was just he just got it. It's that big, it's that. Yeah. Just multi-hit things. Oh, we tried to catch a roll in from... You tried to catch a roll in, maybe, with a down there. Oh, no, did you get it? Nice, uh, didn't get, like, spiked by the back here too far. Nice. Yeah, he's got a lot of parry-up tilts. I think we didn't see a lot of them last game. We saw a lot of them in the first game. Oh, no! No, oh, that could have been epic. <laughs> That's some damage. And now she has the stage. Ah, nice. Sick. Combo breaking tool leading to a kill from Brad. Nice. Whoa, get hit by landing there. Take dash back, back air, back air. Slick him to the side. You lucky to be alive, honestly. Well, that's so unlucky. <laughs> Down smash this new thing on the get up. Ooh, it's straight in. You got some. Jump it the wrong way. Rolls in! Nah, lucky. Nah, you can't shield grab Greninja Bear at my screen. <laughs> no way. That was sleek and firm. He has to get this stock though, like, super soon. That was such a nice jump tool out there. Oh, he's doing, doing, doing a lot of work right now. He's got a lot of momentum. Might not matter though. <laughs> no, nah, he's, he's so dead. Yeah. Miss input maybe, or he didn't. He didn't think he would get boosted by the water. Some something something was a miss there. But got boosted up the RB and just an easy out best cover. There's no if it. Corrin has no drift, so it wasn't even like a mix up of like where he's gonna go. Down smash covers yeah. both sides anyway. You can't drift out because then you just miss the ledge. Wait, yeah, you, you just like a floating target. Yeah, there's nothing. You nothing get it done.